Hi Sunil, good evening. How are you? Hi sir, good evening. I am fine. How are you sir? I'm good Sunil. Thank you. So uh, Sunil, just going through your resume, I found a little bit, uh, you know, uh, something different from other profile. Why different? Because you mentioned uh, that you are working in a, uh, I think, a communication department, central government, as a postal department you're working as a postmaster. So when yes, people sir. are excited and people are uh, taking three, four years to taking to preparing to get the job in postal department, why you were moving from central government job to a IT company as a data role? Yes, sir. No doubt it's a central government job and many people like working in government sector. But the skills I learned and the skills I have, I am not getting enough opportunity to showcase my skills in this department. So I'm looking forward to showcase my skills and grow more in the future. So I'm changing it to IT sector. Okay, good. So uh, meet my team uh, manager and the reporting manager the, and my client also present today. They want to know more about uh, you know your job profile so before that you want to know what we are looking yes sir i gone through the jd you are looking for data analyst job okay <clears throat> yeah exactly we are looking someone who have a two to five year experience so who have a managing data as a, we are the also part of a data governance team and managing a lot of data and the data like uh, you you might be heard the gdpr rule and uh, data protection rule, HIPAA rule. Yes, sir. So we 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 are the organization maintaining huge data along with the follow uh, uh, data governance, uh, data quality, data lineage, following all the tools. Additionally, also we uh, apply the data engineering, data management, data science. So I hope this role is uh, suitable for you. Yes, sir. Of course. Okay. Okay. Nice. Uh, can you give your intro what uh, more about you, your profile, what you do exactly in a uh, uh, post department uh, central government of India so that me and team yes, can sir, understand. Sir. Yeah. Yes, sir. It's a pleasure, pleasure to myself, sir. I introduce myself. Uh, I am Sunil Panigrahi. I am from Odisha. I have completed my Bachelor in Science in Mathematics Honours from Barampur University in the year 2018. And Currently, I'm working in Department of Post Ministry of Communication. I have a three years uh, work of experience uh, using Excel, SQL, and Tableau and basic Python. Coming to my daily work, uh, first I check email and according to the requirement of manager or client, uh, they give the input. First, uh, understand the input and proceed through this. I have a I have good experience on SQL using where clause, join, set operators, uh, group by having store procedure and many more i have also an expertise in S uh, excel and advanced excel using filter data validation uh, conditional formatting uh, making pivot chart and dashboards i also use sometimes like uh, data visualization tool like tableau where i can uh, make uh, shareable dashboards and i have a basic knowledge on python and uh, i have uh, expertise in these three SQL, Excel and Tableau and basic knowledge in Python and free time I love to explore things and places and uh, my hobby is doing physical workout and game playing games. Okay, Nice to hear. So uh, Thank you. you are telling that managing a lot of data, postal department data, ministry data in uh, government of India. Who generate the data and where the data is coming? And how you do manage the data? Can you please elaborate? Yes, sir, sure. So basically, there are two types of data we are getting. One is customer data and one is employee data. Uh, some months we are getting customer for a whole customer data and some months we are getting employee data for report building. So the customer data, like what products we are selling, what type of products we are selling and how many products we are sell according to the pin code. So we get uh, the, the data in different states four to five sheets and we have to make a master data by using VLOOKUP or using data validation. Then for more queries, uh, we import into by ETL process into SQL and get more insights. Then we build report and we make business decisions, whatever required. So you just mentioned data validation. Data validation, yes, 
in uh, where you use in SQL and where you use in Excel and where you use in Tableau. Can you please confirm and tell the which topic you that? Yes, sir. Data validation we use in Excel in like mobile number where the mobile number does not exceed 10 digits. And uh, in Excel, we don't use that validation, sir. We Excel just we go through queries to get uh, more insights about the information. Mm -hmm. And uh, in and in Tableau, we just build reports in dashboard, sir. And what about SQL? What which topic you are considering for data validation? Mm. Data validation in SQL. Sorry, sir, I can go through this. Okay. In us, if you like a where clutch, what do you mean that yes, where clutch and what are the operator available in where clutch? What are the different operator used for a daily data management? Yes, sir. Where clause gives the specific amount of records. We specify a specific condition. Uh, it uh, it filters the it filter, filters individual rows where where clause and uh, it gives specific records according to the condition. We can use where clause in select statement, uh, select, insert, delete, update. Yeah. Okay. What is group by function? And uh, when uh, when you use group by in SQL? Sir, actually group by is used to uh, sort the rows and group by is used, uh, commonly used with an aggregate function. Um, we can also use where and having clause in group by, but where is used before group by and having is used after group by. Group by is actually used for uh, grouping set of rows with the aggregator function. Okay. What is the SQL constant or the type of a constant available in SQL? <clears throat> yes, sir. There are five to six constants like uh, primary key, unique key, not null, uh, then check and default. And what is the difference between primary key and a unique key in a SQL constant? Sir, primary key and unique key both identifies uniquely, uh, but uh, we can have only one primary key, but we can have two or more unique keys. Like primary key is applied to employee IDs and unique key is applied to like um, mobile number and email. That should be unique. Okay, right. So uh, coming to like the SQL uh, data mapping, uh, as you yes. mentioned, I, you do ETL data management project, you are expecting data, data transformation. Till now, what a transformation you applied and which ETL tool you are using? Mm, Microsoft Data versus SQL. So. What about ETL tool? Which ETL tool you use? Mm. I think Manta. Okay. Don't okay. Nice. What is the SQL function and what are the different type of function you use in SQL? Mm. SQL functions like sir rank, dense rank, Windows function we are talking about. No, I'm talking about functions. Mm. Okay. Can you write the syntax how to find third highest salary? Or even you can yes, say, tell that a scenario it is fine? Yes, sir. Uh, but I should, like, uh, we use uh, row numbers or select, uh, uh, select top three employee, uh, row number over order by salary descending. Uh, Group by salary, descending like that. Okay, we can drop a, even if you write, you can drop a message also. That okay, sir. okay. So tell me, what is data normalization? How how uh, why you are using data normalization? So data normalization is the process you know, which we use to reduce the redundancy or repetition of uh, records in the database. Okay. Data analysis process is a normalization or denormalization? Yes, sir. Which one? Normalization, sir. Normalization. 
tell me what is a schema and explain the types of a schema yes sir uh, schema is the schema is like uh, named objects uh, there are three types of schemas like uh, star snowflake and uh, and one i'm not recalling galaxy star in star galaxy and hyperop and in star schema like one factorable around that uh, factorable in the middle and around dimension stable and in uh, star and ne next one like uh, there are two or more dimensional tables uh, attached to one factorable like okay what is a pivot table and what are the different attribute in present in pivot table sir pivot table is like uh, well using um, using charts we use pivot table and we can also use uh, um, slicer to make more filter to the charts by by con connecting two or more pivot tables because it, it by using this we can make the visualization according to our choice what is the difference between csv file and dot xls file um, csv is comma separated value and uh, um, i know but i can't recall sir that okay so tell me the list of uh, uh, you know uh, data filter use in uh, tableau sir uh, data filter like we use filter on measures we use filter on dimensions we use filter on data source and uh, a quick filter these four filters we commonly use what is drill down sir drill down is the hierarchical relationship sir um <laughs> mm. like like in excel we do drop down like in this table we do drill down hierarchical relationships okay yeah i think almost i done sunil so do you have do you have yes, any sir. question for me yes sir of course uh, if i'm selected for this company sir i would like to work uh, on remote location sir if it's possible i would i would be very happy that uh, still not decided this is going on discussion Till now, what I have knowledge it is like a hybrid model. Okay, so not sure. Uh, HR will get back if you are selected. They will give you the clarity. Okay, sir. Okay. Thank you. Uh -huh.